Hi, thanks for tuning into my friends list how-to video. Today we're going to talk about the add-on pack, the friends list, which was created to run with the Steam Party plugin. Now it is a dependency to have the Steam Party plugin to use this pack right off the floor. Sure, you can probably uh, switch it around and use other functions, but it is made for Steam Party plugin for now. Anyways, let's get started. So what I want to do is go ahead and I have the example project for the Steam Party plugin loaded. And what I want to do is go ahead and add the friends list pack to the content folder from the launcher. So now the friends list pack is installed. The quick couple setups you need to do is go ahead and open it up. And we see blueprints. And underneath there, are the main things we want to look at is the theme manager, the C friends list component, and then also the example player controller and example game mode. Now for the Steam Party uh, plugin, we already have a player controller. So what we'll do is open this up and we can see the example code that we need to copy into the Steam Party player controller. Now, it's I've componentized this along with all my other future packs to make it super simple to install the existing setups. So we'll go ahead and go to the Steam Party blueprint, the PC example. And now what we want to do is go ahead and add a new component, click on that, and type in friend and add this friends list component. Now we have a friends list component. Now what we need to do is go ahead and add a, on the event begin play, add another execution pin. Go to the PC friends example, and on the begin play, I want to copy all this here. Copy, and then bring it over to PC example, and, and paste it, control V. All right. That's pretty much it. For now, for testing, I do want to add a test a way to open it up. What I did on the example, I have O, so for O for open. Control copy, and go ahead and paste that here. Hit compile, save, and that's it. Really, that's really it. So we'll go ahead and hit play. We should see, if we, oh, we should see something pop up. Yep, we see the friends list pop up. Right now, since inside the editor, the Steam API doesn't work, so we have to get outside the editor, and we want to make sure that it gets populated correctly. So we'll go ahead and stop this, go ahead and exit the game, and what we want to do is hit launch game. All right, once the game is up, we want to make sure that we do have Steam uh, activated. We can hit shift tab, and see that Steam is running in the background with your game, so everything's working on the Steam side. So we'll go ahead and hit O, and what we'll see is we do populate automatically. So we have what party invites we have, uh, friends online, we can close that out, friends away, uh, friends offline. And we can open those up, and everything seems to be populating correctly. We go ahead and invite the party, join the party, uh, but that's not integrated. That'll be the next part two of this video, and we can click off here, and we click on this and see that we still have the old friends list, and some of the items are in a way of the integration. So on the next video, we're going to talk about uh, integrating it with the Steam Party plugin to uh, visually uh, match it up and connect this button and move these things around so that it lays out nicer. So thanks again for watching. If you have any comments on anything showed in this video, please comment below and I'll get to them as soon as I can. Thanks again for watching. Bye.